I'm downloading an episode of Lost that I found on ABC.com using Replay Media Catcher 4. All I had to do was open Replay Media Catcher 4, click on the Start Recording button, and then go to ABC.com and start playing the episode I wanted to capture. The cool thing, though, about Replay Media Catcher 4 is that I have also set it up to automatically convert any of my recorded files to an iPad format and import it into iTunes as soon as the recording is finished. In fact, I'd already finished recording an episode from Season 6 that was playing on ABC.com. It's finished recording, and now it's converting it automatically for me. As soon as it's done, I can go to iTunes, and I'll find the episode there for me. It's really a great feature of the program. In fact, Replay Media Catcher 4 has over a hundred different popular formats for you to choose from. Basically, every popular device is listed here. All you got to do is select your device, click on it, and it'll automatically convert to that device's format for you once it's finished recording. As you can see, this episode of Lost that the Replay Media Catcher 4 had been converting has obviously finished and has already been added to iTunes. All automatically, all without me doing anything. It was pretty fabulous. So the next time I plug my iPad into my computer and sync it with iTunes, these episodes of Lost will automatically get added to my iPad. It's a great way to get TV shows that you love onto your iPad. You simply open Replay Media Catcher, click on Start Recording, set the conversion settings to the type of device that you want to upload your streaming media to, and in this case I, I set it to the iPad, and start recording. The rest just happens for you automatically. It's pretty neat. I hope you enjoy checking it out.